Right people, welcome to Back to Europe with Deportivo La Coruña and you join me for the start of a brand new season. There's lots been happening in the summer with new signings, there's new faces, people I will introduce you to in a minute, but it's not been easy. It's been very difficult to pick up players. It's, it's a vicious circle. Lots of agents and players tell me that they'd love to come and play for us, but they won't talk to us until we get promotion. To get promotion, we need better players. The better players don't want to come to us till we get promotion. It, it just goes round and round. Um, but I've managed to bring some people in and I will introduce you to those guys right now. So I should explain that bringing guys in was an absolute necessity. We've lost uh, our best players, our three best players. They all retired at exactly the same time. And we had two low knees in that were our next best players and we failed to get them to come back this year. So we're looking for five players minimum. But I have managed to find some people. And if you look at the tactics screen, this will be a new face at the top. And I will be absolutely honest with you. His name isn't Gary. Okay, um, This guy had a name that was about four yards long so i went in and changed to a nickname and welcome to gary so he's playing up front he's going to be a backup striker and i think he can do just that a backup um we did uh, bring in another guy uh, and this was a bit of a, a panic on my part i brought him in and he's going to be back up to the backup um if he doesn't like the playing time that he gets, his club can recall him. It's not going to be a problem for us. But the, the jewel in the crown is going to be this guy, Alvaro Rodriguez. He's a four-star striker. He's got heading ability. He's got jumping reach. We're going to be picking him out at set pieces and floating crosses into him. And he is really going to turn things around for us if he can stay fit. If he can't stay fit, well, we've got enough backup, haven't we? Uh, another guy we brought in is this guy uh, in midfield. And Victor Masigwe. So he's going to be playing a Mazala on support. Usually I play a box-to-box -box midfielder there. And I'm, I'm going to change things up a little bit. So I want to give us a little bit more punch going forward. And I think this guy can do it for us and uh, Eteke will be moving up behind, filling in, and instead of a defensive midfielder on defend, I've put him on support, so he can fill in when my Mazala guy goes forward. Uh, at the back, Paris Adot has now left us, and again, hands up, Gotchi, that's not his name. <laughs> but it is now. Again, uh, he had a, a, th a three, four yard long uh, name he's a Georgian so we changed it to Gotchi I honestly couldn't remember what his real name is now but it, it would be off the screen to be honest and on the other side we've got a guy in um, to send a he's going to do a job for us he's a full-time sign-in and so they're the replacements for the guys that have gone and today I'm fielding my best 11 uh, for the game away at Oviedo um, but the, the jewel in the crown Alvaro Rodriguez his match load is very heavy so I'm going to bring him on last 20 minutes maybe but he'll be making his full debut in the home game in midweek so look I'm excited to get cracked on with this uh, always full of hope new season uh, the board they're looking for a top half finish i'm secretly thinking that we can maybe do a little bit better than that i'm looking for playoffs at least um the media they think that we are going to finish 10th which is an improvement on the 13th that they gave us last year and our odds are 20 to 1. so they were 25 to 1 and we were predicted 13th but i think on the strength of the players that I've brought in, uh, they fancy our chances a little bit more. So, um, 
not getting a lot of response from what I'm saying to the people well hardly any to be honest so um, they must know what they're about is all I can say so let's kick things off first game of the season and my brief is to the lads really don't get beat there's nothing worse than, than losing the first game of the season it is a danger it could be downhill from then on so let's stay positive and let's get a foot in here and stop this highlight before it gets much further and there it is we put it out for a throw and that should be the end of it and it is so corner to us on the far side and they deal with it you'll notice I'm playing with a balanced mentality I usually play cautious away from home but I'm going to see how this pans out I really want us to get, get off to a positive start So Gotchi down the right hand side, cuts it back in, gets it back, ball inside, a poor ball inside I must say, but we cut that one out, Ateke comes forward, Gary Soriano tries to place it in the far corner, but it must have got a nick off of someone because it's going to be a corner. And Valcarce will lift this one in. And that comes to nothing. So we win the header and the knockdown. Well, that was... Uh, a positive ball forward but no one's getting anywhere near getting on the end of that again we win the header and the knockdown Jamie Sanchez with it and this is looking good this is looking good he's in the box shot cannons off a defender and it's still with us and we've made a class of it but we're back in with a chance there's a shot and the keeper got hands on it I think he did so Valcarce will lift this one over and it comes and they deal with it But it's very encouraging so far. I think we're going to have to work it into the box. And maybe be a bit more expressive. How about that? So we're coming up to the half hour mark. Five shots, none on target. Dangerous looking free kick to them. And that's gone over the top. I think it clipped someone on the way through, so they will get a corner. Over it comes. And it's a goal kick. I thought you said it was a goal kick corner to them far side over it comes and we've dealt with it for the time being and that was a decent shot the keeper wasn't sure if it was going in so he made a dive for it
absolutely bossing possession here 70 30 and we really need to, to score when we're on top so gotchi with it down the right hand side inside valcarce oh that was a decent effort and the keeper fumbled it round the corner a couple of minutes to go to half time the corner's going to come in Soriano with it and he's still with us Valcarce lines up the shot and it's cannoned into a, an absolute raft of players so half time is upon us nil nil so it's time for everyone to dig in and give you everything you've got left tonight we deserve the win to win this match so let's go and do it and again a miserable response particularly from the defenders nobody listens to a word I say anyway Opposition instructions by the assistant and we are good to go. So we'll get things underway. To send a weighing up his options. Ball forward, nothing comes of that. And again, we win the midfield header. Gotchi picks it up. He's off down the right-hand side. Ball in, Valcarce shoots, and it's blocked. He had plenty of time to pick a spot there and was unable to do so. So we should build from the back here. Jamie Sanchez with it. Yanateke, Mesaguer, Soriano, Gary, Valcarce. It's all looking good. We need that final ball in. Here it comes. Free kick given. as we approach the hour mark. So we've got a corner to defend. Over it comes. And we get ahead on it, but... He's, well, really, we're lucky there. He should have done a bit better, but... We're going to have to face down another corner. No, we're not. Brilliant. So, 20 minutes to go. And that means the introduction of our star man. If I can find him. There he is. So... Rodriguez comes in. Is there anyone else who needs to be swapped out? You know what? I'm going to leave it as it is. Soriano. He's only on a 6. 6.3. And he's been booked. So I think we'll take him out as well. Team Talk. Go out there and see if you can score the winning goal. Absolutely. And off we go. So, just 10 minutes to go. Not a lot happening. 12 shots, only one on target. That's not going to win you many games. So, a couple of minutes to go. And we punt it forward 
and again we win the midfield header for Alcarce. Four to Rodriguez is the star man and he slots home. What did I tell you people? Start the car. Absolutely brilliant. So let's let's drop this back and defend this lead for the last couple of minutes. Come on, time's up, time's up. Blow the whistle. Ball in. And it comes to nothing. So that should be. And there it is, people. My master stroke, my master signing has done the business for us. So a very nice victory. Well done. At last, a positive response. So, opening day, 1-0. Very pleased with that, away from home. So I hope you can join me for the next episode. I'll bring you back in a few games time. If you've liked the video, drop a like, leave a comment, good, bad or indifferent. But most of all, hit that subscribe button. You know it makes sense. So once again, thanks for joining me. See you in the next one. Bye bye.